Welcome back to part two of our deep dive into the world of entrepreneurship and innovation. Let's kick things off with workforce assessment and planning. This crucial step lays the foundation for a thriving business landscape. Take Barcelona, for instance, where strategic job transitions in waste management were implemented. It's a shining example of the power of upskilling and reskilling programs. As we can see, effective workforce planning is integral to a thriving entrepreneurial ecosystem. Now, let's dive into the heart of our discussion, fostering entrepreneurship and innovation. It all begins with incubation and acceleration programs. These tailored initiatives provide startups with the mentorship, resources and co-working spaces they need to flourish. But without funding and investment support, even the best ideas can falter. That's where venture capital funds and seed funding programs come into play, connecting entrepreneurs with investors who believe in their vision. Yet, it's not just about the money. A supportive regulatory and policy framework is integral to this ecosystem. Streamlining administrative processes and incentivizing innovation can make all the difference. For a real-world example, let's look at Barcelona. This vibrant city has embraced these elements, providing robust entrepreneurship support that has transformed its landscape. From embracing smart city initiatives to supporting job transition in waste management, Barcelona has shown how fostering entrepreneurship and innovation can truly revitalize a city. With the right support, entrepreneurs can truly thrive and transform a city, as we've seen in Barcelona. Entrepreneurship doesn't happen in a vacuum. It's all about building a strong network. In this interconnected world, the strength of your network can be a significant determinant of your success. A robust network can open doors to opportunities, provide insights from diverse perspectives, and foster a sense of belonging within a larger community. This is where networking and community building events come into play. From conferences to hackathons, these platforms unite entrepreneurs, investors and industry experts, sparking meaningful conversations and collaborations. But it's not just about the people, it's also about the partnerships. Supplier development programs and public-private partnerships can enhance local business capabilities and leverage private sector expertise, respectively, leading to mutually beneficial outcomes. Take, for instance, the city of Eindhoven. Their transformation into a leading smart city didn't happen overnight. It was the result of strategic collaborations, a strong network of entrepreneurs, and a shared vision for the future. As the Eindhoven case study shows us, a well-connected entrepreneurial ecosystem can drive a city's transformation. But what about the skills needed to drive entrepreneurship and innovation? Well, it starts with education and skills development. It's about collaborating with educational institutions to design tailored programs that foster a culture of innovation and entrepreneurship. Workshops on startup development, for instance, can provide practical insights and tools for budding entrepreneurs. Next, let's talk about community engagement and awareness. It's crucial to implement digital inclusion programs, ensuring equal access to technology and digital literacy across the community. By bridging the digital divide, we can foster an environment where innovation can thrive. Targeted workforce development is another key aspect. It's about focusing on underrepresented groups, offering tailored training and mentorship programs. Inclusive hiring practices, such as encouraging diversity and unconscious bias training, can help create a more diverse and inclusive entrepreneurial ecosystem. Take, for example, the case of Brainport Industries campus in Eindhoven, where skills development has been at the forefront of their strategy, resulting in a thriving entrepreneurial community. The right skills and an engaged community are key components of a thriving entrepreneurial ecosystem. Lastly, let's touch on two crucial aspects of a successful entrepreneurial ecosystem, inclusivity and ethical data use. Inclusivity is about more than just fairness. It's about tapping into the full potential of a diverse workforce. By encouraging diversity and inclusive hiring practices, companies can harness a wider range of perspectives, fostering innovation and driving growth. In addition, engaging community members in planning, decision-making, and co-design of solutions ensures that those solutions are tailored to the needs of the people they're designed to serve. 
This co-creation process can lead to more effective and sustainable outcomes. But there's another element that's equally critical, the ethical and responsible use of data. As we increasingly rely on data to make decisions and drive innovation, it's vital that we have robust data governance systems in place. This includes privacy protection, bias prevention, transparency, and accountability. Let's take the example of Barcelona, where smart city initiatives have been embraced with a strong focus on job transition and entrepreneurship support. Ethical data use has been key in making these initiatives successful, while inclusivity has ensured that the benefits are widespread. Similarly, in Eindhoven, transformation into a leading smart city has been accompanied by skills development, collaboration, and innovation. Their approach underscores the importance of inclusivity and ethical data use in driving progress. Inclusivity and ethical data use are not just nice-to-haves, but essential components of a thriving entrepreneurial ecosystem. As we've seen in Barcelona and Eindhoven, when done right, they can drive transformation and innovation. As we wrap up part two of our deep dive into entrepreneurship and innovation, let's take a moment to reflect on the essentials. We've explored workforce assessment, the power of networking, and the importance of skill development and community engagement. We've underscored the necessity of inclusivity and the ethical use of data. Remember, fostering entrepreneurship and innovation is a multifaceted process, but with the right approach and commitment, it can drive transformation and growth. Until next time, keep innovating!